How is everybody doing tonight? Doing good? Doing good? Let's make sure that, uh... All right, Kyle, you here? Kyle's here, all right. Messaged me on Discord, said he's here. So I hope you're here in chat. Oh my goodness. All right, so this is a big occasion for me. Mr. Kyle, my patron, changed his tier this month to a booster box. And he messaged me about it first and he said, I would like to do a booster box with you. And I said, sure. He said, but only if it's Kaladesh. And I was like, well, I already have a couple boxes sitting around. So, sure. Of course I have it available. Um, by all means. So, um, he's going to get everything he wants out of this box. Anything, anything and everything he wants out of it. Um, we're going to open it up. Now, knowing my luck, and knowing if you guys have been watching <laughs> my videos, you'll know that I have a very hard time pulling masterpieces and inventions and what have you, the Masterpiece Series cards, the lottery cards, for myself. I've pulled one for another patron. Let's see if we can make it two. Let's see if we can make it two different patrons that both get an invention before I get my own. I think that's only fair, right? That, and that's what I'm hoping for right here for you, Kyle. So as long as you're here in chat, as long as you're here watching, you can message me on Discord and just let me know you're... I mean, you said you're here, so I'm assuming you're good. So we're just going to get right into it. Now, don't go away either, because we have a few other things to do in this video as well. Um, I did get my last piece of patron mail from Salmon. Um, so I'll open that up on this video as well. And then we might have some other stuff, depending on how, mon how many people we got kicking around and who's interested in doing what and all what that, you know, we'll see. Depends how many people are here, who wants me to do what. But we'll, we'll play it by ear. How about that? We'll play it by ear. Let me just do this here. Give me an idea of... How many people are here? There we go. Since it's not my box. That's what I figure too, Aaron. That's what I figure too. But hey, you know what? That doesn't really bother me. Because that means that I'm pulling something sweet for my patron. And he's getting something back for the money he's helping support me with. What up? Uh, not much, man. Not much. I'm happy to be here. I'm happy to be here. I'm looking forward to going to Philly next week. I leave on Thursday. Sam, and I'm actually supposed to talk to you about that because uh, I wanted to talk to you about schedules and stuff. Like, uh, I'm only coming down with one other guy now instead of uh, two of my buddies. I'm coming down with one of my buddies. Um, and uh, we land pretty early on Thursday. And then we leave pretty late on Monday. So if you want to do the other stuff you talked about wanting to do over the weekend, Thursday evening works for us if you're we're not working, or Monday any time during the day works for us. Um, if that's something you want to do, it works for us. All right, Kyle, first pack, blossoming defense. Let me get this mouse out of the way. Boom. Blossoming Defense, worth a dollar. Keeping that for you. Long finned Sky Whale, not so great. Janjeet Century, and a Sky Ship Stalker. Alright, well. Every pack can't be a good pack, right? Are we gonna go watch the Eagles play? I don't I don't know, to be honest. Um, and the reason I say that is because I'm specifically t going into Philly for packs unplugged. Um, Harness Lightning, very good. Perpetual Timepiece. Um, and the reason I'm going to PAX Unplugged is because it's a tabletop only convention. So I'm hoping that there will be some sweet, sweet uh, magic card stuff there because it's tabletop only. We'll see. 
We'll see. I'm sure that they'll be pushing um, Iconic Masters down everyone's throat for the, you know, quickfire events and all that kind of stuff. Oh, man! That swamp looks beautiful! Holy moly! With the, with the spirally grass. Man, that looks great in foil. That's a sweet pull. I hope you like that. I hope you like foil lands, Kyle, because you're getting that one. Man, it looks so nice. All right. But how are you guys all doing today? You're all here with me on a uh, Saturday night. Boom. Scrap Heap Scrounger. Also, hi, Rick. I'm sorry I missed your entering the chat there. Welcome. How are you doing? All right, Kyle. Scrap Heap Scrounger's not so bad. Oh, I see a foil back there. I see a foil back there. I don't know. Can we get there? Okay, first Mythic, Cataclysmic Gearhulk. Oh, man! A foil Blooming Marsh! That's sick. That is some sweet, sweet candy right there. Nice. Now, Blooming Marsh is not the highest uh, priced land in this set anymore, I don't think. Um, it, I think it was second to Spire Bluff for a while, but I think Concealed Courtyard has come up quite a bit. But yeah, man, Foil Blooming Marsh is pretty sweet, though. Diabolic Tutor. Confiscation Coup. So now, right now, just so everyone's aware, what's happening here is I'm opening this box for Kyle, my patron. And, uh... I'm going to ship him all the rares and all the uncommons that are worth something. Um, and then anything else he wants, he can just let me know, and I'll ship those to him as well. An Aether Flux Reservoir. Is a very good card, I agree. Alright, what do we got here? Boom. Boom. Huh? No. Oh, no. Oh, via, oh, via. <laughs> it's alright. I get it. It's Saturday night. Autocorrect is a pain in the butt sometimes. Oh, there's an Ether Hub. Sweet. Parado Paradoxical Outcome. Also a very cool card. Oh, that's awesome. Aaron, that's awesome. I'm glad you went out and celebrated appropriately to remember our uh, our vets. That's good. Long Tusk Cub, very good. Authority of the Councils. All right, Kyle, we're down to the last two packs in the first row. How are you feeling so far? Cataclysmic Gearhulk, Foil Blooming Marsh, Foil Swamp. What else? Botanical Sanctum. Oh, and a Foil Renegade Freighter. Alright. Okay. Okay. Of course, I will ship him the foils as well. Um, I'm not a stingy jerk like that. I mean, I gotta ship him everything that he wants out of here. I'll ship him the foils, the rares, the uncommons. I can't remember if you said... Did you say you needed unlicensed disintegrations? I can't remember. So many people have been talking to me about what they need out of these sets. Fumigate. As of late, I've had a couple other patrons approach me and ask for certain things out of Kaladesh and Aether Revolt and things like that that I have to go digging for and find them because I don't know where I've put them now. <laughs> I've sorted them sorted them away to make it organized so that I can't find what I'm looking for. Right? That seems like the perfect organization system. Cultivator's Caravan. Man. Alright. What else can we find for Kyle? Uh, Sky Sovereign Consoles Flagship. Uh, that's actually seeing play in one of the standard decks right now, isn't it? I think it is. I, I feel, I feel as if it is seeing play currently. In, in standard. Maybe not a lot of play, but I feel like it is seeing play. Correct me if I'm wrong. What have you guys thought of the, uh, you know, the Pro Tour last weekend? Did anybody, anybody catch any of the coverage? Anybody tinkering with the decks that are out there? Insidious Will and a Council Shield Guard foil. 
Your best friend is a driver in the U.S. Navy. Cool. Verler, uh, Whirler Virtuoso. I'll give that to you, too, because it's seeing a lot of play. And a sm smuggler's copter. Yes. Got the money rare. The money rare. Oh, I mean before the, the be pre-ban. Pre-ban money, money copter. Got there. All right. Cloud Blazer, Glinton S. Crane, Servant of the Conduit, Architect of the Untamed. Well, Kyle, we're about halfway through the box now. Halfway through. Thoughts? Prayers? Hopes and dreams? Harness Lightning, good. Ceremonious Rejection. Veteran Motorist. Hey, another Blooming Marsh with a Foil Windrake. All right. Been playing Kingdom Death Monster. God, that's that sounds like an interesting thing. Contraband Kingpin, Wisp, uh, Wisp Weaver Angel, Veteran Motorist again, and a Metalwork Colossus. Uh, yet another card that is seeing some play in Standard. It's interesting. Yeah, what? Yeah, what is that? Is a good question, Richard. All right. Contraband Kingpin, Essence Distraction, Incendiary Sabotage. Oh! We got there! Bickety Bam! That's the Chandra we're talking about and the one we're looking for. There it is. Hot fire right there. Hot fire. Hey, listen, if we can't open you an invention, at least we can get you a Chandra, right? It seems fair. It seems, seems fair. Boom. Who doesn't like a Chandra every now and then, right? Depaula, Depaula. All right. Okay. Whew. Man, spicy, spicy, spicy. I've opened up a lot of Kaladesh over the last little while looking for another Chandra for myself, and I haven't found one, and there we go. Found it. Oh, it's for Kyle. <laughs> refurbish. Do you want Refurbish? It's seeing play in Standard. I don't know if you want that. Bombat Courier. Not a bad little rare as well. Also seeing play in Standard. Commander on L.A. class, Aaron. Great guy. Have had a lot of family in the military. It seems to be pretty common, right, Rick? Like, I think everybody knows somebody who's served or, or uh, you know, is currently serving, you know, or has, you know, a loved one who has served. Rashmi, Eternity's Crafter. And they're all great people, right? They do, they do a service for, for all of us, right? We should all very much appreciate what they do for us. They lay down their lives, you know? They risk their lives, even, just just to try and help us out. Eliminate the competition. Let's see that invention. Hey! Hello, Alexander. Yeah, refurbishes the God Pharaoh deck all-star. That's right, Alexander. And hi, Becca. How's it going? Another Ether Hub and a Spire Bluff Canal. Woohoohoo! This box has been spicy. This has been a great box for you, Kyle. I hope you're enjoying it. I think you've definitely got your money's worth on this one for sure. Multiform Wonder, nothing super exciting there, but still. Chandra, Spire Bluff Canal, Blooming Marsh, Botanical Sanctum. You got three of the, the dual lands, and then you got a foil Blooming Marsh. And you've got four Mythic so far. Another Blossoming Defense. Wow. Dynavolt Tower. Holy moly. Three copies of Blooming Defense. Uh, or Blossoming... Blooming... Three copies of Blooming Defense and two copies of Blossoming Marsh. Right? That's how it works? <laughs> Lost Legacy. Whoa, deity. All right, bickety bam. Let's see what we find. Oh, oh, eh. oh! Fateful showdown. A place out of lands. You can hear the crowd go wild. Oh, yeah, woo, yeah. Place out of lands. Woo. And ha! 
Hmm. I feel like if I, if I like karate chop it, you know, give that like, Rah! when I get to the rare, it's going to be better, right? That seems fair, right? I think that's how this works. And, hmm? Hmm? Yeah! Hmm, panharmonica. All right, all right, all right. All right. Not a bad card, actually. Panharmonicon's pretty good. <laughs> I'll give you that. It is a pretty sweet card. Okay. Okay. Uh, Gonti, actually seeing play as well. Ooh, a Dovin Bond emblem. I'll give you that. We'll add that to the pile of things. Have I been smoking my funny money? Probably. It's. I mean, it's made of plastic. It'd probably get you high as hell. That's right, our money is plastic now. Deadlock trap and a foil tasseled dromedary. Actually, we're kind of low on foils, aren't we? We only have, although we have two there, two, six. I don't know, that's still pretty low, I think. Six foils is pretty low for a box. Mm. Ooh, that's our first glimmer of genius. Territorial Gorger. Nobody cares about that guy. If this was my box, I would have just, like, thrown that card away. Like, I'd just be like, toss. Territorial Gorger, no one cares. I have, like, so many copies of that card. It's ridiculous. I think every uh, pre-release kit of Kaladesh I opened had a copy of him. Padim! It all comes down to this. I will keep that in mind, Aaron, because my wife would love that. She is like a huge, huge, like, uh, history and sightseeing buff. She loves that kind of stuff. So, uh, she would totally, totally be super stoked about that. I'll keep that in mind. I'll let you know. And a Lanth new Helion. Actually, uh, actually, my wife's sister may be moving out to, uh, over that way, over to the East Coast in the near future, because her husband is getting stationed out there for the army. So there you go. I don't know exactly where he'll be, but he'll be over there somewhere. Somewhere over there. Anyway, there you go, Kyle. Let's see. Do you, did you message me on... Let's see if we can... Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm. All right, Kyle. I don't know if you're here in chat. But there you go. It's all yours, buddy. You got your Chandra, which we need to put into uh, some sleevage here. Get a perfect fit for the Chandra, of course. Because she's like over $30 currently. So we put her in a perfect fit, like so. And then she goes in a blue sleeve, like this. Sweet box. Yeah, man. I have Discord open here, too, so I can see you're chatting. Um, so I'm going to ship you everything out of here. I'm going to ship you all the rares, the foils, uh, and the uh, the uncommons here. Uh, let me know if there was anything else that you wanted me to look for. Um, I think you told me already sort of what you were looking for uh, in Discord. But just in case anything else has come up that you want out of the, uh, out of the box, let me know. Um, just because, you know... If I have to ship you everything, all of the cards, it gets a little more expensive for me. That's all. And I already shipped you your grab bag for this month, so I'm paying your shipping cost twice. Even though you're, you, you only paid for the one tier, so. But I will do that for you because, man, boom. Thank you for giving me content for the channel. I really appreciate it. Big shout out to Kyle. You guys in chat on YouTube, make sure you give a shout out to Kyle. Just what I had on screen. Okay, perfect. Oh! Knock over all the commons. And by that I mean most of them. Knock over most of the commons. Boom. 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 <laughs> That's because I shipped out your grab bag. 
with everyone else's. And then after I shipped it out, I went, oh, yeah, right. Kyle had talked to me about upgrading, and I forgot. <laughs> All right, see here? Boom. I got this little fat pack thing. There's your cards right there, buddy. And let's, uh, I got a box here somewhere, I think. Where did I put that? Here it is. Boom. Take the darkness. Boom. That's your, uh, that'll be your little package. I'll put these cards into this box and I'll ship it off to you. I'll sleeve up the, uh, the foil land as well. What did you miss? You missed a sweet box of Kaladesh. No invention. But we did get a Chandra. We got a foil, but, uh... We got a foil uh, Blooming Marsh as the foil rare, so that was pretty sweet. We hit uh, three of the other dual lands, Blooming Marsh, Spire Bluff, and Botanical Sanctum. We hit four uh, four Mythics, Cataclysmic Gearhulk, Rashmi, uh, Chandra, and Sovereign's Flagship. Anyway, thank you so much, Kyle. I hope you enjoyed your box. Let's move on. Not to say that what Kyle, you know, did for us wasn't enough, but I've got this, so let's open it. Right? This is some a little love letter that Salmon wrote me, I think. That's what I assume, anyway. Oh, no. Did I cut my mat? No, I didn't. Okay, good. This is the uh, the love letter from Salmon. It's the... Oh, shit. Oh, shit, Salmon. Your cards came out of the sleeves. And, and I don't know if that's glue or what that is, but it got stuck to the paper, and then the cards got stuck to it a bit. I don't know. What's happening, man? Everything's a disaster over there. Just kidding. I'm just kidding. All right, what did Salmon send to us? Looks like he sent us four things. A foil blade splicer? What are you, crazy? Jin of Wishes? Tenth edition? Oh, this sleeve is is atrocious. It's got glue all over it. Ugh. Get out of here. A daring saboteur? And a foil Grull Guildgate. Ah, uh, yeah. Tony and I have got a war going on now, apparently. Speaking of Tony, since he just got here. There it is. If you soak the, the cards in water, it'll fit more snugly. That makes sense. That makes sense. Foil Grull Guildgate. I got something else to send you now, Tony. Look, Salmon gave me a, 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 a guild gate that I can send your way. It's foil. Does that make it better? Thank you so much, Salmon, for uh, for the cards. You didn't have to send anything, but uh, I appreciate that you did. Salmon, for those of you who, who, who watch him and pay attention to his channel, turned off his patron the other day. Like, he's just gone. He deleted it. I still would have given him five bucks a month, because that's just the kind of guy I am. Hell, I'm giving five bucks to Unscrewed still. Every month. You gotta support those lower channels, you know? Can't just, uh... Can't just, you know, let them uh, go about their ways. So, anyway. Thank you, Salmon, for that. Really appreciate it. These cards will go into the pile of other things that I have to deal with and figure out what to do with. I have a pile of stuff from, like, the people who have sent me things that I'm just like, I don't really know what to do with some of these things. <laughs> no. No, it does not. All right, what else we got? I had a thing put aside here. Boom. How about a walk down memory lane? Who wants to do a walk down memory lane with some corsets? Corset hype. 13, 14, 15, and origins. Huh? That would be pretty sweet, Aaron, for sure. Nuclear nucle nuclear reactor technician on your resume. Nuke nuclear.
Let's do a walk down memory lane. Start with the oldest and go with Origins last. All right. 2013 it is. Angel was the first one to speak up, so that's what we're doing. Man, these packs are like super sticky. And by that I just mean like they just like the glue is old and it's plummet trumpet blast Liliana's shade can you guys see these okay? Is this all right? Or do I need to like... Here, I can zoom it in a bit more. So that I can hold them down here with the light. There. How's that? Is that better? You guys can see? Guardian Lions. Water Courser. Mark of the Vampire. Hey, that's a card that most people know. Tormented Soul. Duty Bound Dead, Goblin Arsonist, Battle Flight Eagle, and we're into the Uncommons now. Uncommons. Reign of Blades. One mana, instant, does one damage to each attacking creature. Ring of Evos Isle, so these were the rings that came out in 2013. Uh, essentially one for each color. Um, uh... This one's for blue. It says, you know, equip creature gains hexproof until end of turn. Like, so you equip it, and you can pay two and give it hexproof. But it says, then at the beginning of your upkeep, put a 1-1 one -one counter on it if equipped creature is blue. There was one for each color, and they each did a different thing. Arms dealer, a little goblin. That's, you can sacrifice a goblin, deal four damage target creature. And our rare is a magma quake. Deal X damage to, cre to each creature without, uh, without flying, and each planeswalker. Hey, we got a goat token. Look at that sweet zero one one goat token. And a nice looking island, actually. Very nice, very nice artwork. 2014 core set. My goodness. OMG, the rings nostalgia, right? Hey, Ronnie, how's it going? All right. We can we can get in here. Boom. That looks okay. Oh, why am I? Why did I lose my? Hold on a second. Ah. Ah, uh, everything's everywhere. Everything's ruined forever. There we go. Boom. Okay, Blood uh, Blood Baron. Or ba Baron. I don't know how you pronounce that one, but whatever. Shock! Good old Shock. Can't beat Shock. Claustrophobia. Very good card as well. Ah, uh, yes. Fog. Do you guys remember Corsets now? You t we're taking you back to Corsets? Hey, Rick. Rick, thank you so much for uh, for promoting. I really appreciate it. Giant Spider. Yes, Rick is the only one so far to have purchased one of the mats uh, from my patron page. I did have another person purchase one as well outside of that, um, and I sent that off to him as well. Lightning Talents. Vile Rebirth. They're up on my store, nerdvanastore.ca, for those of you who are interested. Um, they're basically they're just a basic play mat, all black, and they just have the Nerdvana logo in the bottom left. Giant Growth. Of course, we all know that card. Pillar Field Ox, and we're on to the uncommons. Molten Birth. Oh man, the bubbling cauldron combo. Do you guys remember this? I remember this from M14. This was fun times. So there was a witch, a newt, and a cauldron. And what you could do is you could sa uh, so you sack a creature and gain four life. Sack a creature named Festering Newt. Each opponent loses four life. You gain life equal to the life lost this way. And the Witch let you go and get the Cauldron or the Newt, I think it was. Yeah, you see? You hated that combo. Now, the best part of that combo was going black-white and playing Angelic Accord. Because it was whenever you gain four or more life, get a 4-4 four, four Flying Angel token. That was the best part of the combo. By any means. Enlarge! This is an interesting one. It's plus 7, plus 7 gains Trample, and until ends must be blocked this turn if able. And our rare is a... Um... Mag... Megantic Sliver. Megantic Sliver. I guess that's how you pronounce it. Anyway, he's a 3-3 three, three for 6, but really he's a 6-6 six, six for 6. Because it says Sliver creatures you control get plus 3, plus 3. So he comes in and he's like, yo, I'm a big dude. I'm going to make all of the other slivers bigger. 
and that kind of stuff. All right. What do we find in Core Set 2015? Frost Links, Crowd's Favor, Midnight Guard, Invisibility, Living Totem, Shadow Cloak Vampire, Flesh to Dust, Blast Fire Bolt, Naturalize, and now we're on to the commons. Venom, or the uncommons, I should say. Venom Sliver. Slivers you control have Death Touch. That seems pretty decent. Cone of Flame. Stoke the Flames. Cone of Flame into Stoke the Flame. And our rare, a Chasm Stalker. Oh, we got a foil. Foil rare? Ha <laughs> ha, Spirit Bonds. I don't know if that's good or not, but holy moly. Foil rare in random four packs. Pretty sweet. I'm okay with that. Uh, so, yeah. Jeez, that's crazy. Holy moly. You're getting into modern and you're not sure if you want to do slivers or whether you want to do uh, Jeskai control. Well, options. Always options. Auromancer. Touch of Moonglow. Arc. Uh, Act of Treason. Mighty Leap. Artificer's em uh, Epiphany. Might of the Masses. Leaf Gilder. Guardians of M uh, Melitis. Fiery Impulse. Very good card. I remember that card being awesome. Return Centaur. Ooh, that's an uncommon worth like a couple bucks still. Sphinx's Tutelage. Wow, they're off camera. I'm so terrible at this. There. There. Now you can see the actual cards. Is that better? Jeez, I gotta like pay attention to my surroundings here. I'm here I am. I'm looking down here at the cards instead of looking at the camera. I should be looking at the camera. Sphinx's Tutelage. Very good uncommon. Worth a couple bucks actually. Um, Thunderclap Wyvern, uh, Valoron Wardens, and our rare Outland Colossus. Womp womp. A night token. Good old night token. No baby Jace for us out of four random packs. That's too bad. I'm going to zoom this out again here. Boop, boop, boop. There you go. You guys can see the cards a little bit better now. And by that, I mean you can just see them more. Maybe not better, but you can see more of them. I want a refund! Who doesn't want a refund? Asher, who doesn't want a refund? So there you have it. M15, M14, M13, and Magic Origins. Little bit of everything. And a couple rares here and there. And a, a foil rare, to be honest. Pretty sweet. Can't really complain about a foil rare, can you? All right. How many people we got here? Ten people? I don't want a refund for the giveaway bundle. Yeah, yeah. Um, so just so everyone's everyone knows, we've got a couple things here coming down the pipe. We're getting close. We're getting close to uh, to a milestone that I had prepped. I have a I have a I have a bunch of milestones prepped. Uh, just so everyone's aware, these are things that I have not mentioned in any of any any of my videos. Okay, but I have two things prepped for milestones. And this is not stuff that I'm necessarily doing for giveaways or anything like that. But it is stuff that I'm doing. So, at 750 subs, we're going to be cracking this bad boy open. Okay? And we're going to be giving away one of these. Okay? Alright? So at, so, at 750 subs, we're going to crack open this anthology's box. And we're going to give away a sealed pre-release kit of BFZ. At a thousand subs, we're gonna crack this bad boy open. That's right. That's a World Wake Booster Fat Pack. 
That's right. And we'll be giving away yet another Battle for Zendikar. So if you have friends and family, and you think they should be watching this channel so that you can uh, get a giveaway going, you know what to do. You know what to do. We have those set aside. That's been in the works for a very long time. I have the product now. It's sitting here. It's waiting. Once we hit those milestones, we'll be cracking those open. For the meantime, and by that I mean... Oh, uh, yeah, I have, I can send him an email, Asher. I can, I can shoot him a note. I have his, uh, I have his email and his phone number. I can, I can text him or email him if you want. Um, I'll let him know that he won something from you. Uh, I think his mind is, like, really off of magic right now. Um, because I think he and the wife are trying to, uh, get a new, new house. Things like that. So he's focusing a lot on other things at the moment. From what I understand. From what I understand. Now, I don't know if that's true, but anyway. Let's end the night off with this. Because I just have one of these laying around. How about this? There's ten of you here. Okay? There's ten of you here. Thank you so much for being here. I really appreciate it. Okay? I'm going to give away one of the two foil lands. To one of you ten people who are here right now. How about that? How about that? Let's see what we can find here. Who is here? We got one, two, three, four, five, six. There's only six participants. Okay, I know there's more than that. I know there's more than that. So speak up in chat. If I don't see your name up in chat, you won't get a chance to win. How about that? Who have we got here? So we've got... Becca? We got... Asher? We got... Angel? Oh, geez. What am I... That's not how you write an Angel. Got there. <laughs> we got Tyler. Tyler N. Who else is here? Who else is here? Aaron, are you still here? Rick? I think Rick and Aaron are still here, if I'm not mistaken. Aaron's here. Okay, so just remember that you have to be able to give me your mailing address uh, for me to send these to you, okay? And send these, I mean send one. I'm sending you a, a land, a foil land from, from, from this pack. Oh, I'm, yeah, there we go. Nope, nope, I'm a broke honky. You're totally here. I just didn't, for some reason, I didn't see you. I'm a broke that's who I'm gonna that's what I'm writing I'm broke I don't know how I missed your name you were I see that you wrote come on full art right there I don't know how I like just like skipped over it's there's a uh, I have no excuse I don't know what to tell you I'm just blind I'm blind apparently there's six of you okay there's only six of you nobody else is interested nobody else is interested all right it's going to be a pretty good giveaway for you guys. And just remember, guys, make sure, make sure, okay, that you leave a comment on this video afterwards, letting people know that they missed a sweet giveaway by not being here. Just make sure you tell them that. Also, I'm thinking about doing another giveaway. I'm thinking about doing another giveaway where I'm going to do something similar to this. Except that what I'm going to do is I'm going to ask you to leave a comment on... Uh, basically what I'm going to do is I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say that I'm going to pick one of my videos at random from the last two weeks. And I'm going to pick a random comment from that video. 
to be the winner. So it's not going to be like a video that says post a comment here. It's going to be one of my videos over the past two weeks. Go and post and you could win something. And I think that's how I'm going to do the giveaway because then it sort of give, entices people to comment on most of the videos, if not all of them. And I would appreciate that because it helps with my analytics and those kind of things. Helps me get more views, which is which it would be great for me. So I would appreciate it if that was the case. I know you guys who are all here and who are all entered in this. You're all regular viewers, and I appreciate you being here. So thank you so much. It's not really for you. It's just sort of like an idea I'm thinking about, and I think I'm going to do it. So anyway, let's crack this baby open, and then what we'll do is I'll pick a winner, and the winner will get to pick one of the two lands. Okay, and you can you, your choice, whoever the winner is. Okay, let's see what we find. Let's see what we find. Oh, I'm Tony Wolf, I can't leave you out of the giveaway, man. You're here. I knew you were here, Tony. I can't leave you out, Tony. Let's put you in there. Boom. YouTube sticks it to the little channels. You're absolutely right, Pekka. It's absolutely accurate. Repeating Barrage. Pretty good card, actually. Cultivator of Blades. Release the Gremlins. Bounty of Luxa. And... Our first foil is a rare. It's a foil Wildfire Eternal. Our second foil is just a regular old bone picker. Oh, let's pull from the back. What a surprise. A Burning Sun's Avatar. And the first land is a mountain. Ooh, sexy, sexy mountains. I really, really... I think the mountain is my favorite art out of her lands. I think, I think the mountain is my favorite. And the forest is also beautiful. So I'll, hold, I'll hold it up so that you guys can see it. Since this is going to be what you guys can win. Alright. Okay. We've only got s seven people in here. Your chances are one in seven of winning. No island. You like the island best though, a Angels, what you're saying? I think the mountain is my favorite. The island is pretty, I'll give you that. They're all pretty. I, I like all of the lands. I th just think that the mountain is my favorite art. I don't know. It just has this very, like, uh, the lonely mountain kind of look to it. I don't know. That just does it for me. All right. Who's ready? What do we think? All right. Okay, everybody. Rick, I didn't put your name in the giveaway because you didn't say anything in chat. Well, here's what I think I want to do. Okay? We're not going to assign them numbers. I want you guys to tell me. We're going to get you guys to pick top or bottom. And whichever one you pick, I'll get rid of. Then there'll be two there'll be either 3 or 4 cards left. Two people saying 5, three people saying number 5. So what is that? 1 2 3 4 5 or are you going 1 2 3 4 5? Okay, so you're saying bottom. Get rid of bottom. Okay, three votes for bottom, one vote for top. The card with the word magic. I told oh, top, top, I mean top. Okay, get rid of the top. So three for bottom. Anthony, Asher, and Becca are saying bottom. Oh, Asher's saying top. Uh, Asher, what are you voting for, man? Top or bottom? Okay, Tony and I'm a broke honky both say top. Anthony and Becca both say bottom. Asher? What are you saying? 
What are you saying? D-Day! Top and bottom, bottom, okay. Bottom it is, bottom's getting rid of. We've got six, we got like six votes for bottom. Bottom is gone, okay. We got three left. We got three left. It's too late, those ones are gone already. Okay, how do we want to do this? Do you want me to mix them up again? Or leave them? Oh, I will. I will. Don't worry. Don't worry. We'll see who lost. And and by that I mean I have them right here. See, you can see them right here. We'll, we'll find out who lost. We're going to find out who, who third and second place are. Yes, that's the plan, Asher. That's the plan. Okay. Middle. Middle is who we're flipping? Okay, we're flipping middle first. Okay? Okay, we're flipping middle. And middle is not the winner. Just so we're clear, we're picking the third place. We're picking third place. Third place is I'm a bro conky. So close, man. So close. Who's next? Left or right? We're picking the next person to get eliminated. Hey, Fifth Moon Magic, how's it going? Left or right? Left? Right? We're doing a giveaway, Fifth Moon Magic. Left, left, left. Left it is. Four votes for left. Aaron J. You were close, Aaron. Almost, man. Almost. You picked your own name. Okay, so this is the winner. This is the winner. Do we want to see who didn't make it? Do we want to see who didn't make it? It wasn't Becca. And it wasn't Tony. And it wasn't Tyler. And it wasn't Asher. It was Angel. Angel, my man. Too many choices you didn't you can't decide? Well, you won. You won. How's that? How's that for winning? Oh shit. That's right. You won, sir. So what do you want? Forest or mountain? Sir? Trash fire? Didn't win the lottery. Didn't win the lottery. Still had a pretty good box though. Still had a pretty good box. Was four mythics, one of them being Chandra. Um, foil, uh, Blooming Marsh as the, fl as the rare, and then, like, two copies of, uh, Ether Hub, three copies of Bloom, uh, Blossoming Defense, two copies of Harness Lightning, like, not bad, pretty good. Alright, Angel. Alright, I'm Brokonky, have a great night, man, thanks for sticking around, thanks for hanging out. Forest would be great. All right. There it is. Okay. Forest is set aside for you, Mr. Angel. You have to send me a message on uh, YouTube. Or you need to uh, send me an um, email. 
which my email is on in my YouTube description as well. You can just email me or you can send me a message on YouTube either way. Uh, and just give me your mailing address, okay? So that I can send that off to you. Okay, and there it is. I'll even put it in a sleeve for you. Because, I mean, these lands are just too pretty not to put in a sleeve. There it is. Alright. And I'm going to put the other land in front of it. So that I know that it's going to you. How about that? There it is. Boom. Am I opening anything else? I don't think I am, but maybe. Let's see. What's that? Sorry, uh, I can't hear you over me cracking this off stream. Off stream. What? I didn't use the knife for anything. Don't even worry about it, people. There's definitely not something being opened over here. Definitely nothing being opened. All right, Trash Fire, have a great night, man. Enjoy your hockey game. Thanks for stopping by. There's definitely nothing being opened over here. At all. Nothing. There's there's definitely nothing over here. I don't know what you guys are talking about. I didn't see anything. Or hear anything. What? Where did these three packs come from? How did they get here? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what just happened. Ignore, ignore the bevers behind the curtain. Everything is fine. Nothing is ruined. It's been a while. You guys haven't seen this set in a while. I've been holding off. I had a third box of these sitting in my house for a long time. And I contemplated whether I should just sell the box because they went up in price. I bought the boxes for about 350 a piece, Canadian, okay? I bought 3 of them, okay? And they're now over like 550 <laughs> and I only bought them this year. <laughs> and I was like, what happened? Um, so I contemplated just selling the boxes to make some money to basically buy other stuff. But then I was like, how can I? How can I not? How can I not open it? Let's see if we can find any of the good commons, right? There's a bunch of good commons in this set. Peer Through Depths is a good one. Not well, not worth anything, but it's a good card. There's a lot of good cards in this set, actually. Just in general. Sudden Shock, that's a good uncommon. Worth a couple bucks. Thundercloud Shaman. Stir the Pride. And our first rare. First rare. <laughs> Blood Moon! Blood Moon! And a foil figure of Destiny! <laughs> Alright. All right. I'm not going to say no to a foil rare. I'm not going to say no to a foil rare. Now, foil figure of Destiny, not as cool as foil... Uh, what was the last foil rare we opened from this set? Was Arcbound Ravager? So, I mean, like... Not as cool as that, but still... But still... No Street Wraith. No Lava Spike. Plume Veil. Marsh Flitter. Tarashi's Grasp, and a Dragon Storm. Another red rare, but not the rare we're looking for. All right. I know, Angel. I know. There's been a lot of good ones. I agree with you. All right. Can we find a Lava Spot? Ooh, Rift Bolt. Ooh, Relic of Progenitus. That's a good one. 
Careful consideration. Oh, that's not really a... Vivid Meadow? All right. All right. All right. Who wants another giveaway? Let's do another giveaway because there's 14 people here now. We've got a few more people in, in, the, in the mix that weren't part of the first giveaway. How about that? I'll give away this Relic of Progenitus. Okay. And this Rift Bolt. If, if we pull a good card. If we pull a Mythic, any Mythic, could be a shitty Mythic, any Mythic, or a Money Rare from this pack, or a Money Foil from this pack, we'll give away these two cards. How about that? Who wants that? Slaughter Pact is pretty good. It's pretty good. Slaughter Pact is a pretty good one. I don't think it's worth crazy amounts of money, but it's definitely worth giving these cards away. So let's do that. All right, who's ready? Who's still here? Who have I got sitting around in chat? Speak up now or forever hold your pieces, people. How about if you pull a token? Yeah, I, I mean, I guess that's true. You don't really get a lot of tokens out of this set, do you? Well, we did get two. We got two tokens, and we got like a... Just a... We're going to give these two away. We're going to give this Relic of Progenitus away and this Rift Bolt away. All right? Let's put those over there for the moment. All right, who we got? We got... We got I'm a Broke Honky, I think, took off. We got Asher. Asher, you're still here, right? Boom. Tyler? Is Tyler still here? Yes, he is. All right. Tony? Yeah, you're still in there. Becca? Becca's still here. Aaron? Aaron's obviously still here. All right, we need some more Lance. We're going to have more people this time. Let's pull out seven. All right. Who else we got? We got Rick. Rick. And we got Anthony. Anthony, yeah. Erickson. Right? Yep. We got Fifth Moon. All right. Who else is here? Aaron, we already got in there. We got Tony in there. We got Rick. We got Bob Jones. Bob Jones. Who else is here? Anybody? Do we still have Angel. Is he still here? Does he want a shot at winning again? Maybe we shouldn't put him in. Maybe, maybe we leave him out, right? Don't forget to like the vids. All right, Angel. We're going to pass you up since you won the last giveaway, if that's all right with you. I hope that's okay with you. Please don't hate me. Did I get everybody? Speak up now if I didn't get you. We got Bob Jones. We got Fifth Moon Magic. We got Anthony Erickson. We got Rick. We got Aaron J. We got Becca. We got Tony Wolf. We got Tyler N. And we got Asher. MTG Asher. And if you guys aren't subbed to MT MTG Asher, make sure you go do so. If you're not subbed to Fifth Moon Magic... Make sure you go do so, all right? They make stuff. They make stuff as well. Make sure you go check them out. Remove you? But I already wrote your name on a card. It's too late. It's too late. Put it this way. If you win, you can give it to someone else. All right? That's what you can do with it. How about that? How about that? If you win, you can give your gift to someone else. Sound good? Hell, you could add it to the patron pile. You could do whatever you want. Thank you so much, Angel. I, I'm glad I, I'm glad that we're on the same page. Alright. 
We'll uh, we'll put these off to the side here. Boom. We always have an odd number. We always have an odd number. All right, we're gonna do this the same way again. Top or bottom? Top or bottom? Let's get some votes going, people. Come on. Boom. Anthony's saying top. Top. Three tops. Four tops. One bottom. Top. Five tops. Is that the majority vote? That's the majority vote because there's only nine of you in here. So top gets re gets removed. Let's see who didn't win. Rick. Sorry, my man. Bob Jones. See, Bob Jones knew he was in the top and he was like, he said bottom. Becca. Sorry. Tony, my man. Sorry for you four, but you're out. You're out. How do we want to do this? I want you guys to pick a card between one and five. We'll flip it. Then it'll be one and four. We'll flip it. Okay, so that's how we're going to do this. Two fours. Two threes. Two twos. <laughs> Flip and rip. That's three fours. Three fours out of the remaining five people. How many how many votes have we had? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We've had seven votes. We had nine people. We got two more votes out there. Hey, stuff happens. That's right, Becca. Don't worry. Listen. I'm in the same boat with you. I'm in the same boat with you. Okay, three votes for three, three votes for four. We need a tie-breaking vote. Who's got it? Who's got that tie-breaking vote? I'm ready. Who's got it? Where is Salmon? Salmon said he made it out to the stream, and then he didn't even, he didn't even stick around. That Salmon guy, man. Tyler, four. There's the tie-breaking vote. Tyler says four. That's four. Five votes. Oh, it ties it back up. All right, Asher, you switch. Three or four. Asher's the deciding vote. Three or four, man. Come on. You voted for two, right? Oh, no, you voted for four. You voted for four. Tyler says four. Asher says four. Fifth Moon says four. All right, Fifth Moon... See, we're tied, though. We're tied, though. We have so many fours. We have, we have four fours and four threes, based on what I'm seeing in this. Oh, Angel changes vote to four. Four it is. Boom. Fifth moon magic. Sorry, my man. Sorry, my man. You're not in it anymore. You're out. Your card's gone. One, two, three, or four, everybody. Who's, who's going to be next to be eliminated? <laughs> I'm going to screw myself. You did it. You did it. I'm going to screw myself. And I did. <laughs> I see one vote for three, one vote for one, two votes for two, two votes for one, four votes for two. Three votes for one. All right, we're going with two. Two it is. Aaron, my man. Sorry, my man. All right, who's next? Who's next? We need votes between one, two, and three. Or left, middle, and right. Whatever you want to do. Let's do left, middle, and right, so that way I can tell who's voted for what. Left, middle, and right. I saw the planes and was worried. Two and two and three. One. It hasn't caught up yet. Okay, right. I feel like Russia is messing with our votes here. 
Right is the right one. Mid, mid, left. Metal? I assume you mean me, uh, middle. Just autocorrect. Autocorrected it to metal, I'm assuming. Yeah, okay. <laughs> That's what I figured. Good old autocorrect, eh, Anthony? It's the, it's the best. Okay, so we've got two votes for right. We have th four votes for middle. Oh, fifth moon's... Yeah, fifth moon's still right. Okay. We have so we have four votes for middle. One, two, three, four. Four votes for middle. Middle it is. Tyler. Sorry, my man. You're out. Left or right, everybody. We're picking the loser. And by that I mean second place. Booby prize. The booby prize, which is nothing. That is erect. I mean, correct. Three votes for left. Wow, we have a lot of lefts here. We got one, two, three, four, five. Five lefts. And only two rights. Three rights. All right, five lefts to three rights. Left is out. Anthony! Sorry, my man. Asher! You, sir, are the winner. You did it. Congratulations, MTG Asher. You are the new owner of a Relic of Progenitus and a Rift Bolt. Got there. Did I flip the planes and worry you again because you were tied with yet another planes for first and second place? And it also started with an A. Funnily, uh, funny enough, funnily, funnily enough, funny enough, all of the people who are written on planes have names that start with A. Kind of a weird coincidence. Maybe like just, you know, maybe just in my subconscious I was like, must type planes for people with A as a name. I don't know. I don't know. Asher, make sure you uh, send me a note or something with your mailing address. And I will get these bad boys out to you. They're going to go in one sleeve, if that's all right with you. I'll put them in there like that. And I'll put your name in there like that. There it is. There it is. We've got our two winners for the night. Thank you so much, everybody, for tuning in. I have been your host, Mr. Bevers. And as you all know, may your pulls ever be better. I'll catch you all next time. Thanks for being here. Woo! It's over. It's over. Okay, it's actually over now. I record that's my outro, but like I mean, what's up? How's how's it going? Have a great night everybody. <laughs>